hello friends welcome to my channel this is your friend and your girl christiana how are you all doing i hope you're doing amazingly and beautifully good so in today's episode we are going to share something amazing yes i want to share two things that you will say i shouldn't do <laughs> that you want me to just just kill me for if you want me not to do those things so just two things and if you want to know what that two thing is I will advise you to take a cup of coffee, sit down, relax, and watch this video till the end. And I will see you later. Friends, welcome back. So, before I will jump into these two things, I want you to just like I said, watch the video to the end so that you can actually understand. In fact, I can I put all my life <laughs> into two things so that, that I don't make this video that so long. And number one thing that you will tell me not to do that will make me a very unhappy woman and a happy lady. So sad. So two things. Number one thing is tell me not to go to church. <laughs> yes tell me say chris stop going to church you know some spouse stop their wife or stop their husband for going to church for me church is if i don't if i'm not a believer if i don't if i don't receive christ as my lord i don't even think i will have this channel for first of all because it's the word i receive from church that makes me have this channel to bring it things that I'm learning to you all. So telling me for not going to church, and people say, yeah, because of church, you just, you know, they're unhappy. Yes, I will be unhappy. First, I am a child of God. And the Bible says, keep my Sabbath day holy. So people say, yeah, you don't need to go to church to keep your Sabbath day holy. Now you're holy. Hold on. Because when you go to the house of the Lord, you don't just go like, I don't go to church like because I'm going to see anybody. I'm not going to church for my pastor. I'm not going to church for my leader or anything. I go to church for myself. Because when I meet church is that when I hear the word of God, being born again, it changed my life. He keep me safe. He keep my family safe. Yes, even the family that I'm talking about, or the spouse or the man will tell his wife, don't do those things. When you go to church, your family, the Bible says, seek you for the kingdom of God and his righteousness. Every other thing shall be added to you. So when you serve God, you don't need to worry about your family. You don't need to worry about your home. Yes, your job. You know, in this time of whatever is happening in the nation, <laughs> Sarah, it's not bragging. It's my best time ever. Because I've been learning through the word of God not to, to be to be sufficient to be okay with what i have and i've learned to love myself i've learned through the word of god to be a better me yes you can be you can be anything you can be everything you want to be through the word of god and this happens when you study when you go to church when you hear those words because faith comes by hearing and by hearing by the word of god so if i don't go to church if I don't receive those words of faith, because anything that the Lord wants to give you, some people say, oh God, I need money. The money, that money that you needed is in the word of God. This is it. This is what I've understand in the word. That's why I say you cannot, you can't stop me. If only want to stop me to not going to church, it's going to be difficult. You know, and when uh, your spouse told you or tell you, don't go, don't use fight. Go see your heart, begin to pray concerning that man or that woman until they let you do what you want to do. Don't use fire. Don't say, come on, hey, he said, make cannot go start raising bottles. Don't do that. You're just going to make matter worse. But continue pray for that person that God will touch his or her heart to be able to do things so that you can do what makes you happy. Your happiness matters a lot. Me, I know they use my happiness to play away. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I don't use my happiness to play. My kids, they are all that makes me so happy. But I know through the word of God I have, I'm able to keep those ones. I'm able to give them peace of mind. I'm able to, to bring them hope in doing my best in the word of God. Because the word of God will teach you. The Bible says it's efficient. It's a train up a child. It's the word of God that told you to train up your child in the way it should go. So these are all things. Anything you desire is in the word. That's why I say... 
Don't stop me from going to church. It is, it is everything for me. It is my life and it is all that matters. You know, the, that song say, he said, take the fame. Take everything. He said, but leave me, give me, leave the Holy Ghost for me. So that is me. Leave my church. Leave God for me. You can take everything, but just leave Christ for me. Hey, have you subscribed to this channel? If you have not subscribed, what are you waiting for? You want to hear what is next? subscribe this is one way for you to support your get it on say subscribe and then click on the bell put it on top that whenever i upload the video you will be notified and if you want to help this channel do us a favor by sharing it out to your friends to your social media aspect thank you very much and god richly bless you keep coming because we have so beautiful things at this channel and your life will never remain the same okay number two thing that you will tell me not to do <laughs> two things that you will tell me not to do that will make me unhappy are you you want to know that thing so before i will continue i want you all to leave yours in your comment section tell me what are the things that you will want me to say more in this channel because we are here to motivate and inspire each and every one of us to strain us in the word of god tell me what things you don't that will do to you that will make you not to be happy as I'm sharing mine and I will love and if you have any topic you want me to teach please leave it in the conversation or send me a message on my IG is Christiana Flourishing so the second thing is tell me not to walk this one will be very surprising to people say ah, ah walk when the man can bring out the money at home or the woman can bring out the money if he said I shouldn't walk I will not walk I will sit down at home that is you for me See, raising children is, is, is another another work for me. I will not lie to you. I have two beautiful ones, but this, there are so much work. For me to have my free time, I need to get something to do. If you live in the country where I live in Holland, you know that daycare is very expensive. Yes, this is your sister. I went to day. I put my daughter in daycare. The salary I'm bringing home is not even enough to pay my daycare. Yes. Even my hero were complaining. Why you just stay home till your daughter goes to school? Magma was saying he's home, but I have to tell him peacefully. I called him. I said, sweetie, you know what? If you want a happy woman, just let me go do this more work. Because when I'm at work, I have the ability to breathe. I have the ability to be myself. I have the ability to socialize. Stay home from Monday to Friday, Monday to Saturday. So, you know, it is it's boring for me. You're screaming with the kids, you're shouting, you don't even have the time for yourself. Some people have time to go to the spa or do shopping. Me, I don't do shopping, I don't go to the spa. The only thing I love to do is just let me go to work, even though it's just three hours, even though it's four hours, even though it's two hours. Give me that time to go so that I can have my social life. It's very important. So I don't know who I may be talking to today. And I don't know what is yours thing that makes you very happy. Because when you are living in a foreign country, especially when you came to a different country, you don't know anybody. The only way for you to socialize, social, social is very important, is try to do something. Try to go to school. Try to... If you, do, you can even go to school and be working. It's possible. I did it when I came. I was working in the daytime because then I don't have kids. So I was working the day and I was school in the evening. So I could able to do that at the beginning of my uh, of my coming to this country. So these are the things that makes me very happy, and I want to keep it, even though it's just most people say yeah, but your money is not that. Even though the salary of the wife or the man is not big, let him or her do what makes them happy. I love the little land for one reason because there's a couple. Someone told me about. He said the man work less. The woman work more. What the man did is that when he finished from his work, he came back home, take care of the kids, make dinner. The wife came back, they eat, and they have a good time. That is one thing. He's a man who wanted to do something. He didn't say my wife is receiving more than times two of my salary. I will see that at two. No, rather, he went and he still do something. And he come back home, do some other things to easily it for the woman. This is it. This is what some people are just feel proud thinking, oh, if I let this woman work, it will make more money than me. No, try to find out why the person want to do whatever you want to do. If it helps the person, you know, some women go through uh, depression 
mostly because they are just busy at home at home with kids and house choices they don't have their social life and this is what this so the, this thing is happening in the world now it's good trying to put you down depression if i the doctors and the nurses and all those uh, psychologists are making a lot of money because a lot of people are depressed you wear everybody down people are not happy anymore so you have to try find what makes you happy and do it and let don't fight with it when you want to explain to your spouse. Like me, I told you, my people say no. But I have to let them know, please, if you guys want me to be happy, let me do what makes me happy. And I am happy. Because if I'm not happy, I will not be able to come here and make this video with you guys. So tell me what makes you happy. And I will see you next time in my video. If you watch this to this time, I want to say thank you and I appreciate you. God bless you and have a beautiful day. Love you guys. Bye.